Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel. It's been a little while now since I put up a video on this channel and there has been a lot happening. Um, I kind of dropped off the planet with Snapchat, not for any particular reason other than I'm kind of sick of Snapchat as an app. Not you guys, not SnapFam, but like, it's almost like, I feel like I'm having this moment with Snapchat, like it's an ex-boyfriend that you know is bad for you. Like you're sick of their shit and you know they're bad for you, but you wanna go back because there's certain things about them that you like, <laughs> such as you guys, so, um, and SnapFam. So I'm like trying to figure out where we stand. So I've been updating both of my Instagram stories on my pet Instagram, which is Kristen Lee Animal. Everything is in the description box below too if you forget and have the memory of a goldfish like I do. Um, and then I also have my beauty Instagram, which I've been updating a lot too, my story. So Snapchat, we gotta have a long, hard talk. I don't know how it's gonna end, but it's gotta happen at some point. So. So I'm back, um, and other than that, I have, um, it's, we've been going through a lot of changes at Arctic Fox. Um, we've had uh, some new positions open up. Um, it's been exciting, but it's been a lot of work to put everything in place. So I've been really focusing on that. And um, so yeah, that's been, that's been a really big chore that I've been really focusing on. I also have been changing the garage. I'm in one of my garages and the other one on the other side is being turned into my animal studio slash room. So it looks like a complete disaster at this moment in time. And so I've been trying to just basically get all of my temporary setups together until my reptile walls are built and delivered. It takes some time. Um, so yeah, I've also rescued a few different animals since I've made a video last. So those are coming soon, um, I promise. But I figured this one would be the easiest just sit down and film because I'm actually starving and need to eat something. So I've been wanting to do this one for a while. This is basically, I'm gonna pull it up right now so I can tell you the price. Um, let me get my facts straight and I'll get right back to you. Hold place. So I will put the price on the um, screen right now because I can't find it on my phone, but I believe the mystery reptile box was $39.99 and I thought it would be interesting to see what they threw in there. The first part of my thought process was it's a pet store, so most likely they're gonna send me all the crap that they haven't been able to sell. So I was a little worried, but I wanted to see. Um, I love pretty much everything that they have on their shelves there. They have a really good selection of stuff. Um, no, this is not a sponsored post, but Triple L Reptile, if you'd like to sponsor me, my email is in the description box, just saying. So I got this box in the mail. Mm, it's right here. Oh, let's not show my address to everybody. Um, so this is the box right here and we will be going through everything. I'm excited to see what's inside of it. Um, let's just go ho ahead and I'll start pulling stuff out. First we have, so also I, I should tell you guys, so it's $39.99 but they tell you that there's like $100 worth of stuff inside, I believe is what they said. So I was like, oh, cool, okay. Okay, this is pretty sweet. This is like a water, slash food dish for a reptile. Um, this could be cool. I don't have a reptile that I could use this for at the moment. Um, actually I do, I guess I could put my leopard geckos water in here, but it seems kind of porous. It might soak it up. It seems like it's more so for like leafy greens and stuff. Okay, what do we have next? So much bubble wrap. They're really big fans of the bubble wrap and LL reptile. Okay, I'm gonna need some help from my handy dandy eyelash scissors. It's gonna take me at least 10 minutes. Oh, okay, so this is a little hide. Um, this would have to be quite a small reptile to fit in here. This is pretty cool though. It's a, it's a Exoterra reptile cave in size small. We have a pro scale. Um, this, I'm assuming you could actually weigh your reptile or food if you needed to. That's pretty cool. Oh my gosh, I literally just bought this. This alone is like $25, so I'm pretty impressed by this box just right out, right out of the gate because I literally think I just paid $25 for this on Amazon or at Petco or something. So this is awesome. If you don't know what this is, this is a digital infrared thermo, um, I almost said, 
Oh, it is thermometer. Okay, you're smarter than you think. So if you don't know the answer, they're just gonna kick you out. Um, not really. Uh, so this is basically, you just like point and click and it tells you like if you're checking like ambient temperatures or basking temperatures, this is super awesome. I bought something that had the probes that go underneath and I just find it really annoying and silly that it's 2018 and I've gotta have like, a probe down into it and then a power cord coming out of the tank too. It's just like, ain't nobody got time for that. So I got this and it works really well and I'm actually excited that I got another one because see how small this is? You think you lose your keys a lot? Try to keep track of this. It's very hard to keep track of unless you put it in the same spot. And currently my reptile and animal room is so disheveled, it's very easy to lose this. So I'm stoked to have another one. Oh my gosh. Uh. Hold please. All right, last few items. I have to say, I have to say this is very serendipitous that they sent these to me because I literally, literally just got off the phone with, geez, good thing that's not breakable. Okay. I literally just purchased a cage, a custom built cage from Triple L Reptile for the Savannah Monitor that I just rescued, which there is not a video out yet, but there will be. And if you wanna see one sooner rather than later, then leave a lizard emoji in the comments below and I will see those and I'll be like, okay, Kristen, get on it. But um, currently right now, I've had her for three days and I'm kind of letting her just relax and not be fussed with. She came from, I'll tell you her whole story in the other video. It's, it's a long story. This is really interesting that I just got these in the box. So that was super serendipitous and just really cool. So I, and these are like three bucks a piece too. So I think I got like four, I got five of them. So that's pretty awesome. Lastly, I swear that they stalk like my social media when they sent me this stuff because I also eventually would love to have a crested gecko. So I have been researching them um, and I have a few of these books on Savannah monitors, etc. but I hadn't had one on um, a crested gecko and I absolutely love crested geckos. I would love to have one sometime in the future. Uh, so this is really cool. I like to be as prepared as I can when I'm getting a new animal. So I'll usually research for a few months until I have everything set up and perfect and ready to go. Oh, and I also got a triple L reptile sticker. So overall, um, based on the fact that the thermometer or the um, infrared thermometer alone is $25 and I paid 39 for everything and I'm assuming that this has gotta be somewhere in the 15, $25 range as well. So I'm pretty impressed with this box. I think I will definitely get it again. Like I feel like fate brought me everything that was in this box for a reason because most of it I can like, oh, yep, need that. Oh, yep, totally could have that. So this worked out really well and I feel like I got some really good stuff. I totally, don't feel like they sent me like the dusty stuff that like doesn't sell in their store. So I'm really pleased with this. This is exciting. Thank you guys so much for watching and hanging out on my channel. I know you have like a million other places you could be right now. So thank you so much. Um, if you enjoy the content on this channel and you wanna see more, let me know by giving it a thumbs up. And please don't forget to um, subscribe if you have not already. More videos will be coming up. We will get on a regular schedule, I promise. I know that it's very annoying when you subscribe to a YouTuber and then they just like stop putting up content for a period of time. I get it. So I'm gonna work on not doing that. So um, thank you guys so much for watching again. And I will link my beauty channel in the description box below in case you've already binged everything here and wanna move on to my other channel. So um, we will see you in the next video. Bye guys.